Hey guys, it's Trisha with I Sell Baby Alive. I got the sweetest email today from one of my buyers through um, my eBay toy store. And she talked about in the email that she really enjoyed my YouTubes because they were kind of normal. <laughs> A lot of the um, Baby Alive channels are pretty out there, you have to admit it, which they're really fun and I enjoy those. But mine is just really just about the dolls that I sell, giving you opportunities to get some cool things for hopefully some decent prices. And my January sale has continued. I've sold lots and lots, as in like more than one at a time um, sets of Baby Alive dolls. And I've sold a few that have just been really discounted. But anyway, Beaver wanted to say hey and he wanted to sing to you. Ready, Beaver? Here we go. <laughs> I love you, Beaver. <laughs> He's something else. Okay, so yesterday I went to the Goodwill outlet to meet my buyer. She's 88 years old and she shops there every day. And I literally buy things out of her trunk. But I had more time yesterday, so I actually went sourcing myself. That's what us eBay people call looking for stuff is sourcing. Da 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 da! Ah, found the abominable snowman. I am in love with this. I think that he is so cute and so funny and so what in the world. And this doll is well, I don't know if you call this a doll. It's called Playing Playing Mantis, and I think it's from the 90s. And um, it's supposed to actually growl and play some music, but mine doesn't work and that's okay and I'm not sure if I'm gonna sell him or not because I'm kind of in love with him so I've just kind of had him sitting on the back of my couch and people are like whoa that's so cool all right this we found not yesterday but a couple of days ago um this is a baby doll mannequin look at this it almost feels like wood her limbs are really like knock on wood but look at that face so beautiful and this doll literally just you know models um baby clothes so i have this on my site and i've listed it for 125 dollars because i've seen several like it that have sold for over 200. so if you know someone that has a baby store and they want a beautiful mannequin this doll can just sit right on a shelf like that so pretty cool in my opinion we also, or I found, whoa, the Grinch. That's why I love to go sourcing after Christmas because people are getting rid of their awesome Christmas things. That who cares if it's Christmas? The Grinch is the Grinch. This is actually a Build-A-Bear. And I saw online that his pajamas alone will sell for $20. And that if you have the Grinch and the pajamas, 40 or $50, yeah. So I will be selling him. I'm probably gonna put some really cool Build-A-Bear clothes with him because I have a ton and I just haven't done anything with them because as you know, I'm into Baby Alive. Beaver, what are you doing? Okay, also check this out. How weird is this bear? Big old long like jointed and it is actually, I think it's an Ashton Drake if I'm not, uh, yeah. And look, it, it'll suck its thumb. Oh, and I'm gonna see if it won't work with just a regular um, baby pacifier, but this is actually mohair, which is what they used to make old, old um, stuffed animals out of. So, thinking that that's a pretty cool find. Might put some clothes on him, I don't know. I'll have to look at other listings to see if uh, how people list them. And then we're always finding all kind of interesting dolls. Here's a, um, this is a Seacrest doll, Aunt Pat Seacrest. And she's in pretty rough condition, but I will definitely um, 
get her all cleaned up, give her a cute little hairdo, and well, look, it looks like she would suck her thumb, but it's not, it won't stay in there. Oh well, she's a big girl. She's probably about 20 inches and not weighted like some of them, but just because of the bulk of her, she does feel fairly heavy. A lot of people will take this seam out and fill her with um, those like, uh, what is it called? The sand or the gravel or whatever, the pellets that, that weight the dolls. So I think somebody will be extremely happy to get her and um, do some really cool stuff to her. And then I'm just gonna take this and show you. Check out that box of Baby Alive dolls. That's what that is. There's a strawberry shortcake too, but those are gonna have to be washed and cleaned and um, taken care of to get ready for listing. I hope that you've enjoyed my short video today. Actually, it's a little longer than I meant it to be. <laughs> but, um, Desiree, thank you so much for the sweet email about my channel. I wanted to shout out to you and for um, commenting about that you love the little beaver. Beaver! Beaver! He's pretending like he's asleep. He does not like to star on the channels. He's probably mad at me because I made him sing. These baby alives have been cleaned. They're waiting on clothes. Uh, stay, uh, keep watching the video so you can see some of the things that I've listed this week. And check my channel often. Go to my eBay store. Look at the um, link below for my store. And next video I make, I will be talking about my new website. If you want to see it, it is in the preliminary stages, so don't judge, don't judge, because it's a fraction of what it's going to be. It is addedtouchesbytrisha.com. Trisha's T-R-I-C-I-A, so addedtouchesbytrisha.com. You can check it out. Um, go to the History of Baby Alive. Once you click that, you'll see a menu. Um, so far, I've only gotten to the year 2006. Because it is going to be comprehensive. But I wanted to put a site together where you can go see all the dolls. I'll talk about that more later. Hope you have a great weekend, and I'll see you soon. Mwah! Quick correction, you guys. This is a Lee Middleton. I am sorry that I gave credit to Ashton Drake. This is a Lee Middleton crazy bear. Look at those big hands. How weird. <laughs>